Oh, they should get fat, right? The companies to buy slaves have the enslaved to brand it. They had iron with the name of the company carved up beneath it. Okay, so they put that into fire red hot from that of palm oil. From that of mill your chest, female your back or your arms will leave the symbol there. There are companies who preferred portion of the slaves here cut for easy identification. Yet those were merciful enough with just a man a small chain to put around here for that same purpose. After branding, that's where the males and the females were put in their respective dodges to wait for the ships to come get them. Now you should know that the enslaved Africans were sold to the highest bidders. Because uh, we had companies here, one company can say, I'm giving 10 guns for slave, two guns for two slaves. Okay, so out of the cacophony, the noise, then they chose to name this place Palama Hall. Okay, because Palama means confusion. Yeah, some of the slaves' companies, we can make mention of Nestle Ghana, Bankley's Bank, Liverpool Football Team, Manchester City, Manchester United. Yeah, all of them were slave companies. Any top up? <laughs> oh, that was all. Okay, as she said, <clears throat> The reason why the place is called Palava means trouble or problem. Okay, give an offer. This person will shout. We will also shout. This person will talk. This person will talk. This person will... So there's some amount of confusion. But in the confusion, they are making business. They are selling human beings. So the highest bidder who can shout harder or who can shout for the, uh, uh, the one selling to hear, I say, okay, then the bell goes. It goes for you. That is why the name Palava, meaning problem, chaos. Thank you.